All right, so I'm back. Let's go ahead and do some stuff. Over here, you can actually fall down into the well and not die, fall to your death and die, but it takes you to treasure. Bombs! Because the bombs. You pick up and throw a bomb, you place, press the A button. Yeah, that's actually really useful. Red ruby. Red ruby. And red ruby. And some blue rubies also. Made up a lot of money I just spent. And if you break open this wall with a bomb, which the game expects, you get ten more blue rubies and a piece of heart. Yeah, get four of those and it makes up a heart container for even more life. Now, you are expected to use those bombs in other areas throughout the town, but believe it or not, there's an exploit here in town that if you know about it, you should take advantage of it. I can't recall how long it took me to realize this was here, but it is something you want to do as soon as humanly possible, though. If you come in here, well, there's just a bunch of pots and a couple of these guys. But, these pots always refill when you leave and re-enter. Now, we, they also give you these arrows, but they're useless to us for the moment. It's the bombs I'm mostly interested in right now. Because many, many things in Leaks of the Past require bombs to find them. So, carrying lots of them on hand is certainly not a bad thing. Sadly, 10 is our limit. For now. We'll be doing more with that later. Go and do a little more gardening here. We also have fairies. Come over here. There we go. Yeah, the rubies will just spear off the ground if you don't pick them up, so you can't be dawdling too much. Yeah, the, the little, um, child fairies. Uh, hello? Guess who? Ah. Oh, please, uh, 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 please don't scare me like that. I'm sick enough. Whew. Did I scare you? Yes, you really did. I was like, uh, was that coming from the game or am I losing it? <laughs> but. But, but yeah, since I've been sick for such a long time, I decided just to. Work. Hey, me too. Um, record me, me doing. Oh, you're sick too? Yeah, a I got a very weak case of COVID, so it's been a week of misery. So sorry to hear that. <laughs> but yeah, I've just been recording me going through this. It's funny that this is a experience that I had when I was a kid, but um, I have looked back at this game with a lot more cheated eyes in present day, just because I think that people really need to understand that um, even though this game did a lot for when it was first released, it is by no means a perfect gem. <laughs> um. This is hard. <coughs> Let's see here. Red ruby. Another red ruby. Another one. And another one. Yeah, so I'm sure by now you've realized... 
if for some reason you did not have 100 rubies when you walked into town, mm. at this point they pretty much give them to you. So you will have that bottle. <laughs> um, and you could actually... What now? Oh. What is with these villagers sticking freaking chickens in pots? Jeez, what the hell? Oh, bottle number two. Okay. Yeah, Links of the Pass is a little bit generous in that department, where they give you two pretty much at the start. Most of the games aren't going to be that generous. I think the only other game that even tries to apply that kind of generosity is probably Ocarina of Time, if you really know where to find them, but... Most games do not. I believe I scared you, though. It also doesn't help that, like, I'm used to no one bothering to come in when I'm streaming most of the time, so... Oh! Sorry, chicken. Ten, ten arrows! No! Do not curse me with the ten arrow chest. That is not fair. That's a joke. Like, if you know a famous Let's Player called Pro Jared, he, uh, he does randomizers for, like, various Zelda games, and he is cursed by the ten arrow chest. Every time he was up a chest, ten arrows. He's like, freaking ten arrows, I swear. I have gotten so many of these freaking chests in these randomized runs, and they're just ten arrows. I never get anything I freaking need, people. What the hell? Um, I can relate. I've done a randomized run before where the game never wants to give me anything I need. And it's just, like, arrows and bombs and rubies. And I'm just like... Like, I have collected half the chests in the game, and I only have, like, two special items. And I'm thinking... Yeah, I'm just gonna quit this run. Like, this is not happening. Like, I'm not getting anything I need. I don't even know where to look anymore. But yeah, like... Um... <coughs> uh, of course, I'm sure that some people that walked in for a second immediately left because... They don't, they didn't like that I was actually streaming, like, shows and stuff, instead of games. And I'm guessing that some people just don't like that. On YouTube or what? Uh, it was... One, two of them were on YouTube, but another one was on, like... Um... Oh, you mean, like, people in the server? Yeah. Um... Yeah, so, like, they weren't taking around for long. Like, yeah, yeah, they didn't want to, they didn't want the boys to be here, but, you know, like, streaming this on YouTube, so, you know, if they listen to you, they listen to you, they listen to you, they I think the big thing is that people are just, well, no, I, I won't say that. I was going to say people are worried about maybe getting in trouble, but no, that's not a thing on Discord. A lot of people do it. Like, a lot of people actually do group streaming sessions for various anime and real shows and stuff. Um, one server that I used to be a part of would do that all the damn time, actually. They would be, like, showing stuff like, uh, stuff that's on Crunchyroll. <laughs> they would show stuff that was on, uh, Hulu, I think, and... Yeah, yeah. So, so it's certainly not a, not against the terms of service or anything, 
but like some people just aren't interested in watching shows though I've noticed um, one person said oh you're watching Pokemon I'm out <laughs> excuse me <laughs> and I was like I was like well jeez didn't have to be rude about it <laughs> Now, one thing I've never done, and I don't even really remember how you do it, and that's accessing the secret Chris Houlihan room. I forget how you do that. Um, okay. But yeah, I, that's okay. Um, but yeah, I don't know how to do that. Yeah, I see you. I see ya. Um, I don't know how to access that room, so and I don't feel like looking it up right now. Let's see. Um Oh yeah, we still got some time left. Um So let's talk the things I got, the bottles. We have two of them, and there's a few different r ways you can use this. Let's go back to town, because there's something I forgot to show off. Yeah, this place is full of these. I don't think you can use bombs on this. Nope. No, that's something else entirely that you need to have for that. There's a bunch of obstructions in the way. Now if you go up here on the way to town... Interesting. He kind of looks like me, but he's playing a musical instrument. Sounds kind of nice, too. You can just sit here and listen to him if you want, and when I was a kid, I did. Like, I would sometimes sit here for an unhealthy amount of time just listening to them, him playing the musical instrument. But, just to save on time here... If you try to approach him, the animals run off, and uh, so does he, I guess? He just vanishes, okay. <laughs> if you walk away for a bit, it looks like the animals are starting to come back, though. But they run off as soon as they see you. Which, it's kind of a bummer. You can't even, like, slowly walk towards them or anything. They will literally detect your presence immediately and run off, so... Now, if you go over here, there's a library. More on that later. But there are some some buildings we didn't go into. If you go in here, this is a shop. They help you. Seems you like the bun. Prices is marked. Yep, you pay to pay rupees for this. Now, if you ever need bombs and don't know about the exploit room, you can get them here. For rubies. A fi a 50 of them, in fact. Um, 
That's technically not worth it, though. You can get bombs other ways without having to pay that many rubies, but it is an option, and I do appreciate it. For a first-time player, they may not know all the places to get bombs, but they may know where to get rubies, so that's still pretty nice of them to allow for that. Option, um, options are nice, so... Is it this room? Yes. This is the one I was thinking of. I can't go out because I'm sick. People say I caught this cold from the evil air that's coming down off the mountain. Sniff sniff. This is my bug catching net. Use it on better, but for now I'll lend it to you. Bug catching net? Or the bug catching net? Maybe some other things you can catch with it too. Yeah, so... You can sometimes find these little baby, not baby, but child fairies on the field. You know, usually by cutting grass, sometimes they'll show up. If you're swift, you can actually take the bug catching net and, um, catch one. I'd love to show that off, actually, but I don't know how long it'll take for another one to show up. But yes, there are... You know what? Just so it's easier to keep track of the time, I'm gonna try to make sure I can always see the time. There. Makes that a bit easier. What? Get off of that. There we go. Yeah, that makes that a bit easier. Now... Um, so, uh, also, if you sneak around the women that obviously have it out for you, you can go into their homes. If you, if you interact with the paintings that are in their homes for a second, rubies come out. I do believe it's a one-time thing, though, so I don't think you can keep doing this. Yep, one-time thing. But you can do it at both. For some early cash. Oh, never mind. Wait, is it this? Huh, no. So, okay, in this house. I guess you can't really do that. Maybe I have to give another house. Weird. You do need to talk to this person. Huh? What's you, Link? What can I do for you, young man? The Elder? Oh, no one has seen him since the Witcher began collecting victims. What? That's your sword? Well, I don't remember the details exactly, but... Long ago, prosperous people known as the Hylian have had this land. Still many treasures that the Hylia hid throughout the land. That's her sword, mighty blade forged against those with evil hearts. It's one of them. You'll say it now is sleeping deep in the forest. Just in the legend. We look for the elder. Must be someone in the village who knows where he is. You take care now, Link. Well, there are people that want my head, so... I should be careful who I talk to. Well, my, my son really liked to play the flute. But he went to look for the golden powers, not returned. Wonder where he is, what he's doing now. Well, saw someone who played music. I wonder if that's him. Seems seemed to be just playing in the forest until I approached him. Sir, very nice young lady at the waterfall of wishing in the hills where the river begins. I think you should meet her at least once. I'm sure you'll like her. Hmm, you don't say. You like Elder? The Grandpa? Okay, but it's really bad people out there. Setting in the palace past the castle. Mark the spot on your map. Here you are. Hmm, interesting. Before we had to skip this, since we didn't have bombs. Oh wait, we already did it, never mind. I'm... I'm being a dork. 
Or it don't, so I mean, that's what I meant to say. Do, 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 do. I do not want to talk to you. You're a brat. But you, I think that's everything here. However, now we need to leave over here. We need to go north. This is the Lost Woods. Hey kids, you cried out for you thieves, don't have the permission. By the way, I heard that one of our ex-members is staying at the entrance to the desert. Desert, you say? Aw, oh, I want it! Oh, I can't climb up. I'm an athletic kid, I should be able to climb up that. Ah, whatever, I'm gonna do some gardening. Out. Really? You're laying a trap for me in this place? Uh. Huh. Where does this take me? Oh, nifty. Oh, that's three of them. Just need one more. How nice. This is it, the Master Sword! Uh, no, this can't be it. Too bad. It is a very sharp sword, though. Yeah, very powerful shit there. Uh, treasure chest? Hey kid, you can't open a chest without paying rubies. I can't? Oh, news to me. If the rubies let you open a chest, keep the treasure that is inside. Will you do? Yeah, this is technically money making game. It's probably random whether you're gonna luck out or not. And I didn't. But with safe days, I can take advantage of it. Man, I'm just not lucky out here, am I? Okay, so they're random the minute that I pay, I guess. Oh, come on, really? <laughs> huh. Oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah, you can actually score big by doing that. But there are much better and effective ways of making money than to do that, believe it or not. I just can't show it off just yet. It'll be a bit before I can show off that trick. Oh, damn it. Uh... Mushroom smells like sweet, rotten fruit. Give this to anyone. You want it. Sweet, rotten fruit? Can anything rotten smell sweet? I admittedly don't know if there's a truth to that. If you go over here, though, you go to the deepest part of the Lost Woods. And here you find... A sword, a very fancy looking one, but we can't seem to get it. Hmm. I'm sure that'll make sense. At this point, it's, it's a little fuzzy on what my experience was like as a kid. I don't remember everything. I do remember getting lost a lot, and dying a lot as a result of that. Uh... <laughs> Um, okay. I already had one, but whatever. But yeah, that's all we can really do in here for now. Out. Do you mind? Try to beat on your friend over there. Maybe I should... 
this have this out just in case it's gonna be important. Although it's almost time to end this one. Oh, you guys are just everywhere now. What the hell? Well, at least you gave me that thing back. There's also this. Is that thing in my interest destiny? May I tell your fortune? Make it cheap. Oh. Focus, you'll find the owner of Sahasrala. Now I'll take 30 rupees. Hope you will be healthy. So if you're ever desperate for health, you can have your fortune told for 30 rupees and you will be fully healed. So that's kind of nice. Due to poor man such as his future, waiting for your return. If you see these marks here, that is a bomb. You do not want to step on bombs. They are not good for your health. <laughs> and yeah, when I was a kid, I kept doing it anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. Wrong button. Oddly enough, the more hearts you have, the more that uh, bargain for 30 rubies starts becoming way more useful to you. Alright, I'll see you in the next one.